You know what, guys? I've been living now here in the Philippines for almost five years. And today, I spent the best 170 pesos, roughly about $3.50. And the whole entire time, I've been living here in the Philippines. What did I spend? What was the best money spent here? 170 pesos? Watch the video and find out. Good afternoon, guys. That's right, it's afternoon, it's not morning. I'm not doing doing my morning vlog, it's an afternoon vlog. Um, what was that, Saturday, Lut? Saturday, Lut's mom mm. came up from the province, so we've been busy. Uh, we had a, you know, a nice Mother's Day meal. Um, Hannah Grace, we haven't seen them and her mom in like two years. Almost two years. The last time we seen them, we were down in the province, down in down on Sherigal Island, when we did all our um, fun and adventures down there. But they're up here. Here's Bing Bing. That's old Bing Bing here. Say hi, Bing. Hi. Bing Bing. She's an adopt. She was basically adopted by the family when she was young, like real young. And uh, so Bing Bing's here, but Bing Bing don't speak much English. No. Or any English. She doesn't even know Tagalog. Yet. She doesn't really know Tagalog. She has, she knows um, their own language from the area they live in. Yeah. So she's trying to learn a little bit of Tagalog. And Hannah Grace forgot some of the language. But they still can understand. But she can still understand it. So uh, we got Bing Bing here. And it's funny because I'll talk, you know, and I'll say something. She just looks at me and smiles, you know. She's a smile, smile. Um, she doesn't really know what I'm saying because it's in English. Um, good kid, real good kid. And out here we have. There's Ma. No, it's Brian. There's Ma. And then Gail. Hello. And then Gail. Okay, pa si okay pa si Brian. My clear English. You my my English. You clear me. Oh, I understand your English. Good. You know more English than I know Tagalog. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, they came up, like I said, Saturday, and they've been here now. Um, it's a good day today, guys. It's a good day. Um, supposed to be getting a delivery real soon, and I'll show you my delivery. All right, so another thing we did today, well, I actually looked at it. Look, picked up Hannah Grace's her achievement awards in school uh, they did an online type thing for the school and stuff but she went today and look you uh she had to return some books too but yeah. what here. do you want me to do um you can do that one you can do this yeah that one okay i'm just going to write it uh, certificate of recognition, Hannah Grace is Morgado. achievement with a high honor on grade seven Wow. Yes, congratulations. And you want to give it to her and shake her hand? Congratulations. congratulations. Oh, no, wait. I need to give her to you. Oh. Like bang, that. bang. Like that. Wants to give. Congratulations. And then congratulations. And bang, wants to congratulations. Yay! <laughs> what else we got here? And then she will have. Oh, we put this one. They don't do. They don't do um, in her grade. They of don't, course. They, in her grade, they don't do um, perfect attendance, do they? No. no, but she did have perfect attendance this year. Yeah. Every morning she got up and she was online. So she got perfect attendance. And of course, her medal. Medal. It's a silver medal for Hannah Grace of a high honor. Congratulations again. Thank you. you want to shake her hand, Bing? You want to shake her hand, Bing? Congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> and that's about of That's course, about if it. you want me to read her card, I can read it to you. Yeah, read her last grade. Okay, the last grade she have, it will be. That's why she only get the high honor because she wants the highest, but she can't because she only needs one more. It will be 95 is the general no, average. What is her grades in each Nine, subject? I need it's three points. Mm. Oh, she needs three points. Uh, fourth in quarter. Eight, in fourth quarter, it is in Filipino in 96. In English, 94. Science is 90. And uh, Araling Pandipunan is 96. Technology and Livelihood Education is 90, uh, 96. MAPI is 96. 
Music no. is like um, Mafi is one with the music art, physical education and health. Uh, yes. Um, Hello. Music is what's the music? The music is ninety eight. No, ninety six. <laughs> Do you need to go back to school, lot? <laughs> no, actually it is because her Mappy fourth quarter. Is over. Yeah. Yeah, Mappy is ninety six. No. Music is ninety eight. No. Oh. Nine. Oh, art is ninety three. Uh, Physical education is ninety nine. Health is ninety eight. Education at pangpakatao is ninety eight. That's why it's ninety five. Ninety five overall. Yeah. School. There it is. Would you like to shake her hand for uh, school bang? All right. Good job. You like. You like a chicken today? Yeah. Chicken? <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So we got another thing today. Good news. Something got delivered what? after, well, I don't know how many days it was. And they told me Saturday, but Saturday came and went. Then they told me Sunday, but hey, Sunday came and went. But that's just the way it goes here. Uh, but guess what? Looks good. You ready? Our couch is back all reupholstered, looks good. They put new foaming in there. You, when we sit on it, we can tell that the foam is new, uh, the back foaming is new, but there it is. They did a good job, a good job. You can't beat the price. The price to have all that done. If you remember, it was more of a brown color. Look what more with, a, yeah. Look what more with a no, tan, yeah. a tan color. You call that tan, right? Look. Yeah. yeah. You call that tan, Hannah Grace? Nude. Nude. All right. Hannah says nude. But if you can remember, the old couch had all the had all the stitching in there and stuff. No stitching. They just did with a solid um, foam material underneath and a solid cover. It used to look like that. The seats. And all these stitchings here, they all kind of like tore out and stuff. So we just went with a solid. Um, but that was a good deal. 9,000 pesos? I don't know. What's 9,000 pesos? 9,000, it will be like uh, maybe. Eight, What's doing the math? Eight, uh, nine, Less than 200 nine, bucks. 9,000 divided by 40. $187. $187, U.S. dollars. Like people left comments and they said, you know what, you'll spend a fortune back in the States just in labor alone. Um, well, there it was, less than $200 and uh, we got a new couch. All right, guys, so every time Lutz's mom comes up from the province, she always brings like just plants and different things like that along with her and uh, there's no exception to the rule this year. They're all back here. Let me let me go back here and I'll show you. I will show you some of the plants here. Now she brought a lot of them. We got them back here. Let me show you. Back here. All right. Here's here they are. They just got them plant. Look, is this one of the plants here or not? No, that's not included. What are these plants? Do you know? Gumamila. Huh? Gumamela. Gumamela? Yeah. What kind of plant? What is that grow? Flowers. Flowers? Yeah. Where'd you get them? Nibor. Nibor. <laughs> <laughs> we got to get more uh, um, pots. pots. Yeah. What do we have here, Lud? I okay, I'm going to ask my tutor. Ano to man? Ay, ko ano man lang ni. Ang gabi-gabi. Ang gabi-gabi. What's that? Ulang gabi-gabi. Iya, ito, ito gabi-gabi. What's up gabi-gabi? What is it? Just a plant? Yes. Uh, I call the flowers. Flower, That's what they call. Ornamental. What about that? This is ornamental? Yeah. Ornamental? Yeah. What about that? Ito ma, ano to ma? Welcome home. What's that one? This? Yes. Oh, this. This one. Yeah. Gabi Gabi. Uh, Gabi Gabi. Gabi Gabi. Do you know what's Gabi Gabi? No, what, what's Gabi Gabi? Evening, evening. Night, night. Night, night. What's that mean? Party, party. Because oh. that's a uh, plant uh, evening, evening. growing uh, uh, like more on evening. Night. In the evening? Yeah, yeah. Oh. What's this that? is the same as ornamental. Oh, that's or, 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 ornament, ornamental. Mm -hmm. That one? That is ornamental. Ornamental. What about this one here? This uh, one. Ito ma? Gibra. Uh, Zebra. Zebra. Yeah. Okay. What about this one? Yeah, zebra lot. 
Ano this ma ano no? Seven colors. Ah, seven colors. Seven colors. Yeah. Why? Yes. Why it's seven, seven colors? colors? Okay. Ah, because they have the the, like camouflage. Like camouflage. Yeah. What about this one? Ito. <laughs> we don't know. We don't know. It's just a plant. It's yeah. just a plant. Ornamental. Ornamental. Oh, yeah. Ornamental. Yeah. Ornamental. Ornamental. I need to search that a lot. Though. Ornamental. Yeah, same, 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 same. All of them. Yeah. So they're just they grow. This wow, one like here. In, in down. Well, they don't. Well, they That's grow like down. That's a zebra. No. They grow down, another zebra. Yeah, you yeah. know why they call it zebra? No. Because if you hear, if you see in. Oh yeah, yeah. Skin, it looks like a zebra. There looks like a zebra. That's why they call it zebra. Yeah, yeah. And. Oh, yeah, this no, one. This one. Ma, how many ma? Where's the tutor? Eto. Ito, ito, maliit. One, one. Scrapple. Scrapple. Yeah. Scrapple. Yeah. There's scrapple in America. Ito ba ano to? What about this one? Ito. This one's nice. Red one. Just. Ito. Panalam ni galam na nilipag Christmas tree. Ah, oh, they called here in the province. They call this one Christmas tree because they said when this one grow up, they grow up like. Big, right. like Christmas tree, and then they put like a uh, Christmas like, yes. and stuff. So right. they call this one as a Christmas What about these tree. here? This one, I think you know this one. We have this one before, but it's the snake plant or something. Oh. I don't remember. And uh, this one here, yeah. this is the called punsoi flowers, punsoi. means lucky, lucky flowers for that year. And this is the same, same as zebra. Yeah. Uh, gabi gabi, but because they all have different kind of right. colors and different kind of shape, so they get different kind of name. So this one is a coconut huh? tree. Coconut tree. Yeah, it's similar with coconut, but it's not a coconut. But it's just like how the coconuts oh. like this have like. There this. it is. What else we got? What do we got growing out here? Uh, that's that's about it. We got the garden out here. What is that again? This one there is coyote. Coyote. Yeah. And then what is all this here? Ouch. This here. That That's is root crops. Root crops. Yes. And those are lemon lemongrass. Lemongrass. We have a serpentina over serpentina here. Serpentina is growing in there somewhere. Yes. But we that's... also have pineapple there. That's yeah. already there. And goyabano that doesn't do anything. Yeah. yeah, they have goyabano. And this is uh, our new goyabano here. Oh. You see here? All right. Yeah. <laughs> all right. So, what did I purchase today? Or what did I get, basically get done today that was worth 170 pesos, like 350 US dollars. Money, money, money well spent. And I'm telling you, to me it's the best money I've spent here. It might not seem like a lot, or it might not seem very special to you guys, but to me it was. Let me show you here. See my chenilas here? My shoes. I turn them this way. These are my Tiva. My Tiva chenilas that I bought right before coming to the Philippines. And the other day when I was out doing a walk, something felt funny. I looked down and the soles had separated. And I was like, oh man. These are, I mean, they, I've walked all over creation and back with these here in the Philippines. And uh, I'm like, oh man, they're, they're blown out. And I know I spent well over $100 on them when I purchased them back in the States. And one of the things here, also with the, being a diabetic, you need good shoes here. Um, the regular chinelas that they wear here, when I put them between, you know, the, with the little thing that goes between your toes, it rubs my toes, gets them all raw. I can't wear them. I've tried many, many times. Um, so I bought these, like I said, before I came over from the States, and they are, they're comfortable. Um, they're just great chinelas. Can't, I couldn't find them here. I could find them online, but I didn't want to buy a pair. So anyways, I took them to the shoe guy. Took him to the shoe guy. You can see, like, he stitched all the way, all the way around. 
on the inside. Um, glued it, because here's where it was coming apart. It all came apart through here. He threw new glue in there. He stitched them. He just didn't glue them. He stitched them. And you can see I've worn these things hard. But you know what? Like I said, man, the best 170 pesos ever spent. And I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding. Um, you wear chinelas here. I mean, yeah, people do wear sneakers, but most of the people wear chinelas, sandals, or whatever you want to call them. And um, I'm, I'm super happy and super pleased. 350 bucks, or 350, three dollars and 50 cents there you go and of course you know what i was so thrilled i gave him double i gave him double what he was asking for and um but anyways i'm gonna wrap this one up um make sure to take care of yourself take care of each other take care of the sick the elderly and the young if you haven't subscribed squash that subscribe button i know there's a lot of people that watch video my videos but haven't subscribed if you could take the time and subscribe, that'd be great. On the way to 100,000 subscribers. Um, and I'm going to leave you guys with uh, the cobbler. It's a cobbler. You know, they work on shoes. And uh, so I'm going to leave you guys with a little bit of the cobbler. All right, guys. So here is the cobbler. These guys are the cobblers. The old shoe cobblers. They still exist here. Um, here's their shop here. Who's the owner? You're the owner? He's the owner. Hello. You're the worker. <laughs> That's my brother. Oh, your brother's family owned business yes. once again. How, how many years have you been here? 22 years. 20, 22 years yes. in this location. Uh, before we were in a, in a highway and right. we transferred here. Wait, for 22 years you've been fixing shoes. Yes. Oh, here and it custom is. Custom made also. Custom made shoes yes. and. But check it out. Nice little cool little shop here. What uh I, I take it nobody wears that guy. Nobody has a shoe that big, yeah. huh? Maybe Shaquille O'Neal, huh? <laughs> and then we made this one. These are all custom made? Yes, custom made. Right. Leather? Yes. All leather. Yeah, this one is a tire sole. Okay. Car tire. Okay. Yeah, this one's car tire. Car tire sole. Yes. That's using every little piece of recyclable out there yeah. yeah that's cool do you sell many cowboy boots yeah custom made also custom made also and i did see this here yeah, this snake big snake. python snake yeah. was that caught in the philippines yes. that snake where at uh, palawan i in bought palawan. that uh, 10 years ago you you caught it no 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 no, I, no I bought you bought that point how long was it uh more than 10 years no how long was this uh, uh skin 14 feet 14 feet yeah up to there <laughs> yeah, you can see it goes from that corner all the way to that corner. Yeah, and th those, that's the mold. The, the shoe molds, yeah. Yes. So, and then there's your material if you're making new, yes. right? So, is this the snake here? Yeah. That's you with the picture of the snake. That's cool. Very cool. So, there it is, guys. What's the name of the place? Uh, this one is Balibago. Name uh, of this store? Mail Shoes. Mel's Shoes. Miles. Miles. Yes. And what street is this on? Uh, Vincent Street. Vincent. Vincent Street. Yeah, if you're going, uh, if you're in Balibago or going to Marky Mall. Right. Yeah, right. you can... Uh, so it's in Balibago on Vincent Street. Yes. So. At, at the back of uh, Flamingo Hotel. Yeah, Flamingo Hotel's yes. up the road. Right up the road is the Balibago City... Uh, yeah, uh, the Balibago... Barangay Hall. Yes. Barangay Hall, so there it is. Rather, rather interesting.